So it has to be too tight? That's not too tight. You just got loose. You got it really loosey goosey. So you got used to it being so loose. Yeah. The thing is the itchy part. I know. But hopefully it won't be so itchy this time around. I hope so. So I think I'm going to start casting at your foot first and then work my way up just because I want to get a good 90 degrees out of the way. Okay. <clears throat> <laughs> right? I don't know how you can record this while I'm sitting here pushing on you and... Well, I think I passed to the worst pain before. Yes. got hard so fast it's getting there unfortunately my water got a little cold so it's taking a little longer for it to set up mm. it has to be with hot water the warmer the water the faster it sets up
Do you want more of your little toe out? Or is you, are you okay with that? A little bit more. You want more? Yeah. Tell me now before yeah. I start doing right. more. Thank you. Yeah. Speak up or forever hold your peace. <laughs> So you usually do the ones that, the first time when they broke or just the second time? Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. It depends. It depends on the severity of the fracture. Oh, because the last time I see the two doctors, mm -hmm. they, they did it. This, the one come in and the other, I think it's the youngest one. Yeah. And uh, they both do that. Yep, so sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. It depends. Oh, okay. Better? Yeah. All right. <laughs> They're like, oh boy, now what's she up to? The hurt part, huh? No, it's not bad. That was the worst, I think. Really? I think so. Yeah, because now I just have to cast now up here and then wait for that to dry. And, cut and it. then I have to make, yeah, so it's still, because this is not enough layers. Mm, I have another. to put some more from here up and then bring it up to here and then let that dry and then, and then cut it. Cut it. Exactly. So how many layers you put? Um, I will do, this may actually be it for the plain color, and then I'll put um, the color on last. So you're going to have to scooch out even more. Yep, there we go. Perfect. But we got to bend you the best that we can. <laughs> the best that we can. Yeah. No, I'm going to need a little bit more. Here's where we need to try to finish up. And then I have to make a mold. I need bigger hands. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this water is too cold. It's just taking too long for it to set up. It's too late for warmer water. It's 
so you need to do the whole thing before it's dry and put the other one too? No, um, I like using warmer water so it sets up faster. Mm -hmm. And so, but now because I've used, because that's where, I mean, it doesn't matter after this point because I don't need to do any molding like I'm doing now with the color when I do the camouflage. Mm -hmm. I don't need to do any molding. It's when I'm doing this, I want it to set faster. It's not setting fast enough. So before you put the other color, you're going to cut it or? Yep. Cut it? Yep. So before I put the camouflage on, that's when I'll um, do the cut along and get everything ready. Mm -hmm. And then I'll do, I'll pull this down and then make it, I'll try to make it as pretty as possible. Mm -hmm. 